Okay, here we're going to go over the palette creation tool and all the updates we've done to it. So, palettes, create new. Let's get started. First, we'll just kind of go over the entire tool. The option for a picture palette inspiration, the five color options, color picker, and similar colors, as well as all the description information for a palette. Starting up here at the picture palette inspiration, this is something that we just added recently, and you can type in the URL to a photo anywhere on the web to get inspiration from it. And since I have my Flickr photos already open here, we can use it as an example. All you need to do is right click on any photo, copy the image location, that will give you the URL to the picture, and we'll paste it in here, and then find some inspiration. And we break down the image and just grab some random inspiration colors from it, and then from those we can add them to a palette. So let's just choose some colors quickly here. I'm just going back and forth by choosing colors. Alright, now we got five colors in there and maybe we'll change this one a little bit. Now that we have our colors, let's scroll down a little bit more to our color picker. And by double clicking any of the colors up here, it changes our color picker to that hue in case we want to adjust it just a little bit or change it. And you can also change the arrangement simply by dragging colors into the order that you want them to be in. Also down below a little bit further with the similar colors, you can find similar colors that are already in the system that you don't actually have to name yourself. So by double clicking it changes the color picker as well as the similar colors. Or for example if we wanted to see all yellows, it's going to find yellow tinted colors, or some blues, or some greens. That green's a little too bright so let me go back to one of the good greens here. All right, now we'll just type in the details really quick to create this palette. And I'll call this one Sock Love. And let's add this palette. Now, this is a new feature that we also added. Because a color wasn't in the system, it prompts me with the option to name it. So this looks like Toenail. And now, we can add the palette. Voila!